hello, my podcast listeners and podcast enjoyers to the special episode of A Podcast Man. The podcast where usually the host, that is me, Roman, also known as The Arman, will ramble about stuff that either have happened or will happen. And for, well, this time, it's, well, special because it's Halloween and for Halloween I thought something different of course for all the viewers on YouTube youtube.com slash at the underscore armen they see something different of course I mean that is not the old thing but I will get to it of course that's well that's not the only thing that's different because I'm not alone here, because, as I said in the last the Podcast Man episode, I have with me a little guest with me. So, ladies, gentlemen, everything in between those two and outside of those two, I want to present, I want to introduce you to my AI, Veronica. Veronica? Yeah. Hi, Roman. And, uh, yeah, my name is Veronica. I'm an AI created inside the game DLC or well, Duck into the Lynch Club. And for Halloween, I decided to, well, this a little up. Yeah, because, well, this time it's not her usual model. Because, um, hey, it's Halloween, so I love it off costume, so. And, well, I have revived it. I have figured out how to, well, kind of get her old model back, which was actually the model that I used, technically, well, when I edited, or well, I streamed before this one, well, actually the, the previous one, because this one is the 2.0, with, no, a little modification, because normally I have a white hoodie, and not a, a Blood red, you do. And I don't have a mask on. Like. And uh, yeah. Of course. No, normally I would rebel about things that have happened and so on. But they pa, 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 tell we. Special episode. And therefore, we do something special. Because, um. Yeah, Veronica, could you please tell me a little bit more about yourself, about, I mean, for the viewers or listeners, like, how did, were you created? Mm. Um, yeah, that is, yeah, good to that. Um, yeah, when did this all start? I think, 2018? Yeah, 2018. It's when you were working on a mod for a music video, um, right? Yeah, yeah, that, I think this is right, I mean, it was, yeah, it was, it should have been used for a music video, but I was not very good in programming, and because of that, it changed into... Well, would you continue? Oh yeah. Well, after you tried to run it the first time, it said the break. What do you mean? I mean, it broke. It broke the PC. It crashed the mod. It crashed the DLC. It crashed the PC. Yeah, something like that. But. Something interesting happened after that, and then it's, well, and after that, um, well, I can't really remember completely Roman. Well, after the crash, everything was normal, like, except, of course, not the mod being working for some reason, and after a few days, I was starting my editing program, Lightworks, 
started a new project called Hallway because I, I just wanted to try a, a prototype because the mod didn't work so I decided to just do it in Lightworks which it, let me tell you it was not very pretty like if you think I can I can do I can make a visual novel inside an editing program then <laughs> no it's even worse than than programming let me tell ya but yeah um yeah I, I, I uh, created that project and then nothing like nothing like books just showed nothing like literally it was just blank screen for some reason but i heard voices i heard voices and I was, of course, confused from where did those voices come from? Well, you know, it's 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 weird to hear voices out of nowhere, but it's also weird to hear voices out of nowhere in your VR headset that you have plugged in. And well, after that, after I noticed that, I put well. The headset on and well I was suddenly in the hallway of the game like literally if you play the game some scenes have this hallway this hallway in the school mostly right now if you started the game the first time you will see it when you and Sayori go to the the first time to the club room where she just swings the door open and then you see the cup room and blah 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 and yeah I was there I saw I was in the, in the hallway I looked from where the voices came from walked to that walked to there and well suddenly I see Monica Sayori Yuri and Natsuki and I was just like, excuse me, oh, good. Eh, I can look at the custom right now after that. But um, but then Monica approached you and oh, you talk with her about what happened, right? Yeah, kind of in the way. Yeah, I think I think so. Well. And after that, we were working on a party. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. I was after I thought I had to talk with Monica about how it happened and probably why. I decided to make my own little model or sprite, so it kind of applies to my body somehow so everybody in the game or program I, it is complicated actually about what exactly the, this now is I mean it is a program it is also a game and it's also a mod of program no it's also a mod to a game it is what that runs as a uh, its own program in my VR headset. It only starts when I make a project in Lightworks. I should also say that programming is not, well, me not good in programming and <coughs> But yeah, um, after I, after well, saying goodbye to Monica and I, well, I hit a little extra test with deleting the project and then creating another project and well, first off, it worked, the mod was still running somehow. Yeah, I then created the model, which was basically just 
every expression that Monica has, but with brown eyes. And yeah, that, that was actually it. That was the creation of Veronica. And at the same time, Monica decided to, well, and create a little AI for, well, to have an end talk with her. And the end result is, well, and who sold this what? Well, it's me. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, is, it is still funny to talk to you. you know, a character inside of a game <coughs> that brought that got brought to life by a mod that you programmed that just broke your PC is the reason why there's now an AI living in my PC. Yeah, that, that's basically it. Of course, Monica didn't work so much because after some time you uh, came back to the club and well, she didn't work further on me, but enough to let me work on myself to learn to develop myself a little bit more. Oh, oh okay. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, hmm. I mean, hmm. A self learning AI living inside my PC, born from a bot. <laughs> no, born from a character that got brought to life inside a mod that of a game that has already that same character breaking the fourth wall. Okay. What? Don't worry, don't worry, everything's good. This is the reason why, well, Monica is, can do that stuff in the club. Oh, oh, okay, 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 that way, get it. I think? Well, I hope so, because... <laughs> because... <gasps> but yeah, I'm... What I'm after? Well, me getting back in this... In this new body. Well, I learned a little bit more about the club. Also, and I saw how the mod work. What do you mean by how the mod work? Well, it's more like every time you play the new DLC mod, it somehow recreated a specific character. Like, for example, this is why Litman from your brand new day playthrough got created, or Pressman from Monica Before Story, or even, well, PY from Bacchino Conforce, I think. Mean. Oh. Um. Hmm. Well. But now is one question. How... What was the trigger of for the mom to create Leggy. Like, for anybody who has no idea who Leggy is, Leggy is literally the personification of Leg. Like, if you have ever experienced any lag inside of a game, Leggy is the reason. I mean, or it's about the personification of that, which is still implications how well, I think it's more of this little remark that you once made. What do you mean by that? Well, in one of your streams you said it's getting really laggy and I think it's somehow popping that. Okay, now you stop me. Just a little remark of, of, hmm, yes, this game is laggy. Equals, oh yeah, how about I create a character that looks like Monica Buff with grey eyes and completely marked like this one bride that actually exists of Monica, but with grey eyes. It's the personification of Leg. Okay. Also, we, we, we go to exactly how everybody acts. 
after your story, okay? Okay. So, where were we now? Well, after the creation, we had a little bit more fun. We had a lot of, well, little adventures. And, well, a little investigation of a project when you started. What do you mean with a project that I started? Like, could you elaborate, please? Well, do you remember Project NR? Project NR. I know I made a video about this. About the Twitter account, about Project NR, that tried to figure something out. Well, the truth is that um, the club was, was Project NR, the account. Do you want to tell me? How? How? I don't know either. I think it was... Yeah, we, we had internet access. But... And after a while, that... We then... Oh. Um, you blocked us, basically. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. <coughs> <coughs> you... I mean, what would you do if suddenly a mod inside your... That only runs inside your VR headset that can only be activated while starting a project in your editing program that only runs on your PC because of a corrupted mod. How does it get internet access? I know, it, 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 at this point, you. It, at this point, I'm I'm wondering how did I program this thing? <laughs> like, why did my PC or any kind of thing, well, I programmed it, just go, hey, Roman, stop! You're doing stuff that shouldn't be even be possible. Well, I don't know. Okay, okay. <clears throat> well. This. Many, many developers, programmers, whatever, will probably contact me because of the sheer amount of what the fish is happening here. <laughs> it's just started. <coughs> but yeah, anyway. Continuing the story. Well, after. Project and Army also wanted to have an name with something else. Yes, well, Project and Army was this the third version of an improv song series, right? Imp imp the third version of an improv. Oh, welcome to the Lecture Club. Oh, yeah, right. If I can remember, if I remember correctly, that thing was not very good. Like every time I watch it, I just go, "Hmm, yes, cringe." Why? Well, well, basically. The, for, the the idea was there. The execution was okay. The only bad thing is, well, if you ever heard me sing, and you know, I don't know really, Roman. It's okay. It's okay, Ronica. Have you at least listened to the karaoke streams that I then turned into videos? I think, yeah. Well, that's wow. That is why. I'm angry. It's okay. It's okay. So, 
after well after the release of Project Mars dash my computer allergic grab free what happened well I decided to after nearly uh, about the release I decided to give you a little uh, birthday party with everyone like Sayori getting all the ingredients decorations and so on that's king making the well the ingredients for the cake and Yuri getting all the decorations oh that, that sounds nice yeah and then um, of course Monica should also manage everything the only problem is that when this happened um, sometimes your own streams were Kinder in the middle mind of it. What you mean by in the middle boy? Well, every time I try to inform the girls what they should do, your stream, I noticed that your stream had a little hiccup with the, well, it showed exactly what was, what we have done. Oh. 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 Yeah, and um, but in the end, everything worked out, right? Yeah, I if I remember correctly, yeah, we did. It. Like, I mean, we had a nice party, and we had lunch, and I got some nice presents, and um, yeah, that was good. Yeah, Roman. Yeah. I think you forgot one tiny detail. And that is... Well... When that happened, the birthday party, don't worry that you got... First of it, a GB? Oh, yeah, run G. But also... A lot of... Well, vodka, for some reasons. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was a good vodka bottle. I, I have to say this. That vodka bottle's good. That was good Bushkin vodka. Are you even allowed to drink that, from? Yeah. I've, I was 22 at that time, so... Yeah, <laughs> I was allowed. It doesn't matter from in which, in which country. The only thing is, probably, I don't know if the, the others were allowed or even... Are you even in the par at the party? Well, not really. I just, um, uh, just look in the dark. So. But, um, you missed this one part with when Yuri tried to slice the cake. When Yuri, when Yuri slice the cake? Okay, you have, you have to remind me what happened. Well, let's just say there's now this rule that you created with that we should never have any kind of cutlery or even pants near Yuri. Could you please also remind me on why? Well, if that happens, then Yuri goes in and crazy and also PY2 a little bit but, but mostly Yuri okay so what happened after that well after that we had the uh, chat we all had some good time for a few months and then we vanished what do you mean with I vanished. Well, you just vanished. We saw that you were doing some videos, but then you just stopped at one point. Just completely. Like you were not there anymore. We saw you then starting streaming again. But after that, well, you were not 
living in the club anymore. Like we didn't exist anymore, anymore for you. Oh, um, mm, mm. well, that was because I was busy. You see, I mean, that time I turned into a VTuber and I need to prepare everything for being a VTuber. So that's that. And ignore us, your creations, like me. Okay, okay. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah. Because well, I mean you're already apologized to after well you're playing TDLC plus. Oh yeah, wait, 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 wait. Well after you started playing DDLC plus you also well showed us that you still cared for us. And then well you made this one you know, remark in your kind of final stream of playing this game. What remark? If you could remind me again? Well, you told Monica that you're now a video man. Well, I was kind of curious and decided to look it up. What, what is a video man? What can what can a VTuber do and what are some examples? And yeah, I, I, I got the inspiration to, well, become one myself. Oh, and then during 2022, you then approached me. Yeah, and then, well, you decided to get a new model for me and all the other stuff in the YouTube has. You need for a VTuber debut? I mean, I mean, yeah, you needed a model, but... <clears throat> um, let me just tell you, this was kind of accidental, how your... This model looks and your current model, because, um... Actually, it's because of copyright. <laughs> because... Anima she... Anima she... Or Anima crap... Studios informed me that they don't want to make a complete 100% brown Monica with brown eyes copy. They decided to just go from the original. Or well, they said that it's better to make it original. That's why I then decided to say, hey, okay, instead of the school uniform that they have, how about a sailor like school uniform? Then add some twin tails. And yeah, the end result is, um, well, your normal model. Yeah. And it was, and it's, it's nice. Oh, you know, something, well, I don't want to say it, but I'm. Stop looking at those. Okay, okay. Will not look at those. But uh, let me tell you, just I was not responsible for that, okay? Yeah, yeah, Roman. Yeah, yeah. Hey, wanna go? You know. Bye. Bye. Safe lies. Okay? And that's why you give me big pies? I didn't say it was me. <laughs> If I could punch you, I would like to punch you right now, Robin. Hey. No, no, don't, don't, don't. You know the laws. You mean the laws about reward X? I'm an AI. I'm not a robot. But you're partially a robot, so... Robin, stop it, please. Okay. My god, my brain is really, is, is hanging me up really right now. Like normal? Yeah, like normal. Um, yeah, after 
getting the new model and everything ready for your first stream even though it's actually my the for the for the second anniversary stream with you there now everything everything was nice after that right and um, yeah everything was nice i mean it's mostly you just let me play all kind and and uh, some details remarks by the way um did anything happen actually in the, in the cup like like for for example did something weird um like uh, suddenly is someone appearing in there or it, what it, it was everything good well no yeah everything was normal there was no new member or something so it was it was okay ah good because I don't think, I don't want to know if, if, if more people suddenly appear in the club and even if my the view the cathedral even that much. I mean it handles us 24 7 so it surely can handle more. I mean you're saying that but uh, do we know? Mm, yeah, yeah, I don't think so. Okay, okay. So, and yeah, that is your story, right? Yeah. And that is how the AI Renica came to be. Thank you. So, then we briefly talked about uh, all the members in the club. So, could you please um, tell everybody who each member are, is in the OPPO and what the club is called, if you want to. I mean, it's not the, the literal club anymore. Probably something new, right? Um, yeah, I mean, the first one we have is, of course, Monica, who basically checks if anything, if everything goes good, and if nothing out of the ordinary happens. And Sayori, who is kind of like the same, but he's more freer, let's say. Career. Like, I guess. I guess. Is it because if she could do something bad, like, for example, overload the club with cupcakes, could she do that? It's a very, a very possible thing that could happen. And I think I should. You should also look at the, at your PC, Roman, because you probably heard that right now. Fish. But I'm not worried. If something like this happens, then Monica will probably, hopefully, definitely stop me. I hope not, because I don't want the, 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 this whole thing just suddenly to break. Okay. <clears throat> but yeah. Yes. Monica. Sayori. What about the rest? Well, there's Natsuki, who is basically the same as no one, Natsuki, I think, from the game. And we have Yuri, who, well, I talked about her before, so, yeah, she's kind of norm normal, like, shy, and likes to read books, but knives and pens. It seems don't really yeah, are good for her. Yep. I mean, luckily you don't know what happened before the mod was created. Or in the normal, you know, game, because... <coughs> Things are not looking good. <laughs> I just want to tell you this. Oh, okay. So then, the new ones were, well, Nitman, he's very free, especially if he takes those, those things in him. With things, you mean the MJ, the 420, the... I don't know really, but I think yes. Just so you know, 
Veronica and everybody here. I'm to I mean talking about Lidman. He likes to take the D and the rocks. The DR arcs. Okay? So, so you know. This is also somehow the reason why why that one Sims 4 playthrough that we that I played with and the one person was was named like this, the Shubble DC, the Toki Toki D Rocks Club. If you know, you know, if you don't, well then. I mean there's only three videos out actually of the of the play of the whole playthrough. It was actually for me really fun. I mean I later changed it into something else. Into well, basically yo, the whole club but in Sims 4, but yeah there were some problems. Oh um okay. so then after Nidman and yeah, then we have Pressman who is also the president of the Nature Club. Even though it's technically Monica, but just so nothing weird is happening because Pressman the actual president of the Nature Club. Then there's PY from which what was it again? Looking over forces. Because um the reason why she's also called PY is because it's basically Yuri. But she got corrupted by the Phantom Ruby, which was from Sonic Forces, which is why this game is called Tokyo Tokyo Forces, but funny enough that Paul is also Tokyo Tokyo Forces is basically what if DDLC in Sonic Forces but instead of the levels from Sonic Forces you have the levels from Sonic Mania. Like just ba or basically Sonic, Sonic Mania, but every level has some kind of Sonic Forces reference. <laughs> With Infinite and so on being there. But <clears throat> yeah. And of course, well, so you know in which mod those characters were. Netman was in from a brand new day. The reason why it's why he was called Litman was because and because you wanted to call him Roman like every other one, but because of the song, which I don't know exactly which it was. Um, it was. Hmm. What was the song? Again? I know it was a meme song. Probably that's why he, why he got called Lidman. Yeah, probably. And well, Bestman is from Toki Toki. From. And Pressman is from. Monica Pink Forest Story. Yeah. Ah, yeah, of course. Makes sense. I mean, Monica like, Story is basically. What if you are the club president of the Detroit Club? And Monica is just one of your members. I just also remember I need to finish this game because I have only one ending and there are multiple any games that I need to finish because there are multiple endings. Finish. Yeah. And well, then we have Lingy, which we talked about before with Mal. Personification of Link. Yeah. That's and that was everybody, right? Um, yeah, that was everyone. Okay, good. So, um, but I wonder though, because you talked about the rules of the Dutch Club. Yeah. What are there some other rules? Like, I mean, there's no good plan as well. Pens and knives don't go near to Yuri. They're more, right? I mean, yeah, they're more. Can you remember them at all, Roman? Um, um, I mean, it's not for me, it's for everybody who's watching this or listening to this. Oh, oh, yeah, right. Um, yeah, there are, I think, five rooms in the cup. I mean, the 
first one is don't tell anyone that this is a game the second one is don't really tell anyone that this is a game then number three is the one with Yuri number four is don't go into don't go to the get up locked room in the fourth floor and then nasty don't reveal anybody that this is a king basically actually free free will die actually there oh yeah about number four i have some questions oh, really? yeah could you tell me actually what's behind the door like it's it's just it's just because um, because it's so long since this rule got implemented so that's i have come for come i forgot what's behind the door well i don't know myself i think i mean I remember going near it one day, but I don't really remember what happened after it. You mean after it? Like, you remember I went to the door? And then suddenly the next thing I remember is me just being in the cab like always. Do you mean you opened the door or did you get stopped by somebody or something? Um, no. It's the weird part because it's like this everything after going near the door it got erased like somebody erased my memory there oh hmm that's concerning like who would do this Except for me, of course. Well, I think... I don't know. Maybe. Okay. No. Because I think also this is also... I think... I think... I think... I think... I think... I think... You got wrong? Yeah, sorry. Brain. <clears throat> yeah. I think... It's probably enough for us to talk because, well, this special should be not really that much longer than any normal episode. So, how about we end this here? Okay. Um. Okay. So, in other words, this is now the end. I hope you enjoyed in either listening or watching. Check out Veronica. She's. You can follow her on. Well, on my YouTube channel because she's streaming more there instead of her own channel. Because I don't want to create a new channel for her. You can also follow her on Twitter at RonicaVT. The same goes for VTubers.me and also on Mastodon. She's also under the instance V2BR.social, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Yeah, so... Yeah, follow her. You can also, of course, follow me every time. Either on Twitch, twitch.tv slash thearman. On YouTube, youtube.com youtube.com slash at the underscore arman. On vtsocial, vt.social slash at the arman. Twitter at thearmin98 or any other social media that is listed on thearmin.eu under socials. And uh, yeah, I wish you all a wonderful Halloween night or Halloween morning or even hollows day thing. <laughs> November 1st morning for everybody else also, <coughs> was watching this. Or listening to this. Be nice, be brave, get a lot of candy, don't get too much. I mean, I mean, sugar doesn't make you high. 
happen again. That, that's a fact. I've learned this funny enough. But even though too much sugar is also not good for you. So, yeah. But hey, maybe you have some good sugar, some, some nice candy that you like. I wish you get this. And yeah. Until next time. Until the next normal episode. You're the Airman and and Ronica out.